China will host a regional security conference in Shanghai next week. It is called the Conference of Interaction and Confidence Building Measures in Asia. According to China's foreign ministry leaders and representatives from 46 countries and international organizations will attend. Russia's President Vladimir Putin will attend and pay a state visit to China. President Xi Jinping chairs the summit and will de deliver a keynote speech. CCTV's Zhang Nini reports. A new national security strategy for China. In the earlier meeting of the newly founded National Security Committee, President Xi said the body should balance domestic and external security needs, as well as those of individual citizens and territories. It's an overarching concept on security. The new approach stresses on both conventional security risks and counterterrorism efforts. On the domestic front, China is facing increasing terrorist attacks. Just days ago, assailants slashed at passengers and set off explosives at a train station in Rumqi, capital of Xinjiang Uyghur Autonomous Region. The attack was carried out following President Xi's pledge to bolster national security at the front line of anti-terrorism efforts during his recent tour to the rest of the region. It was yet another outrageous attack after a similar one in Kunming City only two months earlier. In the wake of the series of attacks, China has begun to conduct anti-terrorism right control drills. Armed patrol in some Chinese cities are becoming a regular feature. Terrorist attacks have entered into a new phase in China. Internationally, the U.S. and Western countries are adopting a double standard on terrorist acts in China. They link them to ethnic, religious and human rights issues. Domestically, China is facing complex economic and social situations. Some social issues in ethnic regions could have been easily taken advantage of by terrorists. China is also vulnerable to a rising number of cybersecurity threats. Revelation from former NSA contractor Edward Snowden have proved that a lot are coming from the United States. The Central Internet Security and Informatization Leading Group was established the last month to address the challenges. The national security outlook is China's response to rising security challenges both at home and abroad. It focuses on domestic security, the safety of ordinary Chinese, and security issues beyond China's borders. China is also calling for more international cooperation based on equality and mutual trust. Zhang Yingyi, CCTV, Beijing.